Hi guys, Sean here from StudyClix, and in this video we're going to be taking a look at Theorem 12, which states that if we let ABC be a triangle, if a line L is parallel to BC and cuts AB in the ratio M is to N, it also cuts AC in the same ratio. So as you can see on the left hand side of the triangle here, uh, we have two lengths, uh, four from B to the light where the line L cuts AB, and then from that point up to A is the length six. So in this case, our ratio m is to n, which just represents two numbers, is going to be 4 is to 6. But we always want to represent ratios with 1 on the left-hand side, and that's kind of just convention. So we're going to divide both sides of this ratio by 4, which is entirely possible and, and allowed, because a ratio is just a relationship between two numbers, uh, not unlike a fraction dividing on top and bottom. So we're just going to divide across here by 4, and we're going to be left with the ratio 1 is to 1.5. And all this theorem states is that this ratio is the same on the side AC as well as on the side AB. So we know that the length from C to where L cuts AC is 5, and therefore to find the last remaining length here on the right hand side, we're just going to represent it as a ratio 5 is to 1.5 times 5 because this is how we uh, multiply in ratios. So 1.5 times 5 means our ratio on the right hand side, which is going to be the same as 1 is to 1.5 is 5 is to 7.5. And again, we've just multiplied uh, 5, which was on the left, by 1.5 to get the value for the right. Which means that the length from A to where L cuts AC is just going to be 7.5. And the last thing to keep in mind here is this is only going to be true where L is parallel to BC. So in a case where L isn't parallel to any of the sides, uh, something like this isn't going to be possible. But as long as that's true, we can uh, say this is true for any triangle in general. So that is it for this video, and I'll see you next time.